Hey class, we're going to talk about the volume of a rectangular prism. So this right here is a rectangular prism. It is three-dimensional. To calculate a rectangular prism, we do length times width times height. Sometimes they'll also say the base. So the base is just length times width. So if I had this, it's just the base. In a rectangular prism, it does not matter where the base is. Other uh, prisms it does, but rectangular, anything can be the base. Uh, and then we times it by height. Just going to go over a couple things, the difference between surface area and volume. So surface area is something that's flat. I've just got a little model here of a one centimeter by one centimeter. That makes one centimeter squared. So flat things is squared. Uh, if we are going to go into uh, volume, it's three dimensional. So this is one centimeter cubed and we put the three on top to show that. Uh, so right now I'm just going to calculate the surface area of this right here. You can see that I've got them labeled 6 by 4. So my base is going to be uh, 24 centimeters squared. And now I need to times it by the height. My height is 3. So I do 24 times 3 and I get a height of 72 centimeters squared. Length times width times height. 6 times 4 is 24, my height is 3, so my units are 72, and this happens to be in centimeters. And I'm going to add my cubed because this is three-dimensional. So if I wanted to, I could fit 72 of these little uh, cubes into this rectangular prism.